Hey guys, welcome to Stranded Deep and welcome to my airborne base. Oh yes, I worked super hard on this. It took forever. I'm not lying. It feels like it's been 200 years, but it's only been 32 days now in this game. <laughs> so anyway, before we're going to go over to the house, I'm going to give you guys a complete walkthrough of it. I'm going to tell you guys exactly what I built it. I'm also going to make a speed build video of this place so you guys can see it in the future. Uh, I'm not going to attach it to this video because I did see with my first bungalow island that, yeah, these videos can take quite long. But yes, it is completely detached and it's still up there. That is so cool. So anyway, before we go up there, I just want to say thank you to my boat over here. If it wasn't for this boat to bring back all those resources, I would have been struggling so much more to do it. So anyway, yes, I just placed shelves on there and then I went to other islands, chopped down all the palm trees, put all the logs there, bring all my logs to this island, chop it down further and made a lot of wood and a lot of planks as well. Here's my plank station. I use all my planks, but I've got some extra palm leaves and etc over here just to make sure that my water stores up there are always like kind of full. So yes, then we got some corrugated over here. We got my bird stores over here, and this used to be my little house right over here, my little shelter of no campfire. <laughs> but anyway, that is cool. Everything is nice. So yes, let's talk a little bit more about the air base that you guys have been waiting for to see. So yes, technically what I did was I just placed stairs all the way up. Just know with the stairs all the way up, you got to place a flat wooden plank. Let me just see what you actually call it. It is this one over here. So a wooden floor. Yeah, you got to build like a wooden floor in between all the stairs. Just makes it so much easier until you get there to the top. Then I just technically spread it out. And then yeah, when I was done up there, because I actually left the stairs there, so I can keep on running up and down, up and down, taking all the loot down, like all the loot that's down here, I can take up there. So once I finished with that house there, I started breaking the stairway down, and then yeah, until I was down here, so I left my gyro uh, down here as well, so that I can fly up there. So as you guys can see, I've got like a gyrocopter pad over there. So yes, so before I go up, I just want to tell you guys one more thing. So uh, the thing that I want to tell you guys is how I came across this glitch. So technically what happened was when I was making my bungalow island, I made, actually I don't know for the people that did not see my bungalow island, but yeah, technically I made a stair like a uh, this pathway out on the right hand side, a pathway out on the left hand side, and I brought them together. So when I wanted to bring them together, I wanted to make one helipad, so it went up with stairs, so I can go in and uh, like underneath it with my boat. So at the top, I wanted to make a helipad, so then I got second thoughts and I wanted to make two helipads. So then when I was trying to break the thing down, I saw that like I, for example, let's say this part was attached to something. And then I thought that if I'm going to break the one down, all the things that was on it is just going to fall into parts into the ocean. Which I think everyone thinks, but then it didn't happen. So I physically had to run and jump to the other side of the platform to chop it down and then fall into the ocean if it makes any sense. So yeah, it was crazy. So since then I was like, I gotta do this. I gotta try. And I also came across something else that I'm gonna make in the future as well. Okay, but now I'm talking too much. Let's get up there. Let's get up there. Okay, so here's my gyro. Alright, so we're gonna go in a little bit. So it is not the best, I, I I believe it's not the best, but I really tried very hard. So we, you guys can obviously let me know in the comments what you guys think about this, if this is really that awesome. So yes, I'm going to put my gyrocopter over here, you guys won't see it, but I've got a flashlight down over there. So if I do come in from very far away, I can see this, like, this entire thing lights up. So this is technically just a square with a flashlight in the middle, so pretty cool. I, I like it, and we got our stairway going up. And then yes, here's my front door. Oh gosh, I forgot to, to add a front door, but that's okay. It's not like anyone's going to come and try to steal anything. So yes, on my right hand side, we got all the water stills right over here. So I got one, two, three, four, five of them. And in here is water still, but these are technically just palm leaves. So two, three, four, five. So obviously I just saw now that I'm going to add some water to all of them. Two, one, two. Okay, so we got to get four more. One, two, three, four. Uh, one, two, one, two. There we go. So yes, our water stills are full now. So yeah, obviously we're gonna keep on uh, producing water, which is awesome. So if we do get over here, these are my. This is like my food area. Like for example, uh, I've got my new to cook food up here, which is my seagulls. 
then my already cooked food, which is smoked. I don't cook them, I smoke them. And then down here I've got my rations. As you guys can see, I've got a few large pieces of meat in here and etc. So I can start it running as well. I've got some extra birds here. I've got five exactly to put in here. So I can actually run both of them, which is pretty cool. So yes, and then obviously I've got my kidling up here. And yes, if we go to this side over here, I've got like a bunch of crates. As you guys can see, my cloth, more cloth. My air tanks, flare guns, flashlights, duct tape, like all of them are renamed spyglasses, leather, label maker, and etc, and etc, and etc. So that is pretty cool, I also enjoy that. So yes, and then I got my tanning rack over here, I got my loom over here. So yes, so far this is really good. I mean, there's not so much you can add in the game. Like, I wanted to add a few tables and stuff, like especially here at the top. I was thinking about adding one or two tables over here, just to make it look a little bit better. Oh my gosh, what the heck is that? That just popped up now. Oh, there it's gone. I can see the blur up there. Let's get closer. That is crazy. What is that? Anyway, so yes. This is my second floor, so I've got my bedroom over here. I found Wally, everyone. Here's Wally. Some bandages and a lantern. So yeah, the bandages is if Wally falls on my head or the steam falls on my head because I don't know actually how I tighten it down. <laughs> but anyway, so yes, here's my bed. Also, I got my light over here, so it does really help at night. And then, if we come this way, uh, this is technically where I keep, like, clay, extra rocks, fibrous leaves. So I don't have to, like, go down every time to my island to get something. So I got clay here, rocks here, fibrous leaves, my hammers, my axe. But yeah, pick axe. And then, also, I have other axes, but I use it to chop it down. Oh, no, it's going to start raining. So I got my crude. Oh, gosh. This, this thing, what is this? Okay, then we got some sticks, we got some logs, we got some planks. Also, here's my fuel parts. All of these are my electrical parts. So, this side, I've got my fuel still. I think that... No, okay, I didn't make any fuel. But I've got my farming up there. We'll, we'll go look at that now. Then I've got my furnace, my brick station. Not that I'm going to use it. <clears throat> Sorry, not that I'm, I'm probably never going to use this. But just to have it, though, is pretty awesome. So, we got my engine parts. We got gyrocopter parts. We got air filters, which is pretty cool. If we do go up here, we got my farming area. So here's all my potatoes. Potatoes. Let's just grab them. Alright, there we go. So there's all my potatoes. I can go put them in the fuel cell. So I got one, two, three, four, five potatoes. These are the PP plants. As you guys can see, there's a PP plant over there. I don't know what this is. But anyway, so here we got two yucca uh, leaf plants, which is good. We got a table over here with a water skin and a water bottle, which is obviously full, just to make sure that I can keep these full. But it is raining now, so that is good. And then over here, I've got some more crates. So I've got my fibrous leaves, got my PP plants, I've got my potatoes. So we can put our PP plants there, and one potato over there. So yes, I'll be with you guys as soon as this rain stops, because it's extremely loud. Here is to another beautiful sunrise in Stranded Deed. So yes guys, this was technically the tutorial of my airborne house. You guys gotta let me know in the comments what you guys think about it. I mean, I'm super loving it, especially Wally. He seems happy. He's, he's smiling though. So yes, and I don't, I kind of rushed the top. But yeah, as I was saying it, I've got five potatoes. One, two, three, four, five. I've got my pee, pee plant. And I've got these yucca trees over here. So yes, then I take all of the resources that I get from them and I put them over here like fibrous leaves I've got some rope over here at the top we put our pee, pee plants in there potatoes over there so yeah I've just started farming recently but obviously I'm not gonna be playing this probably again because I did make the tutorial I did make the base so yeah I don't know what this is is this a plank wood over here that's glitching out it's like it's not rendering in or something yeah, check that out. Okay, but anyway, yeah, so that is it, guys. That is it for the airborne base. I want everyone to please let me know in the comments what you guys think about it. If you guys think it is awesome, do let me know, please. I would really, really appreciate it. But yes, thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you guys got any questions or whatsoever, I'll just drop in the comments. I'll help you guys out. Do drop a like on this video, please. I would really, really appreciate it. If you guys would love to support the channel, hit the logo at the bottom right corner to subscribe. If you want to see a similar video, hit the icon on the left. If you want to see my most recent video, hit the icon on the right. And then, yes, for you guys, I will jump off because I know that's what you guys probably want, right? All right, let's go. Let's go. And kumbayash!